Hello, people! This is the Black Love Gamer, and this is my review of Until You Fall. Published and developed by Shell Games, released August 27th, 2019, and currently it's in early access in the Steam Store for $19.99. Okay, now as far as this early access title is concerned, they want to have the game completed by early 2020. So, as far as what the game actually has right now, you have several different swords, axes, daggers that you, that you can use. There's different enemy types, and it's about two-thirds of the campaign that's available. And I, this, this title, this, this title is, is, is great. This is, this is a great-looking game. I'm loving the combat. It's a roguelite. You die you try again but you're not really starting from the beginning because you're able to collect something called aether aether will allow you to uh upgrade your weapons and whatnot and when you're upgrading your weapons it'll give you little stat boosts uh your shield will get stronger uh you'll be able to get special abilities where you're able to whittle down the enemy shield and then once that once that happens then they'll be in the state where you can do combos. Uh, light will come up, it'll be in yellow, and you'll have to actually swipe in the direction that they show. When, when you're doing that, you you do a lot of damage to them. Yes, and then, you know, and if as far as with the um, enemies and weapons and things of that sort, another good thing about it, about this game being an early access, they will be adding more enemies, more weapons, more augmentations upgrades and whatnot to this title and i'm i'm like wow and they're going to be taking a lot of info from the community in order to make the game better so just because what we have as far as with their roadmap is there there may be more things added on and shoot and just like with other games that that you know come out of early access and become a full title the, that does not mean shoot we might mess around and have some DLC going this this man this this thing is hot so they have a little storyline you start the game off the uh, stages you you know you have a boss but there's like little stages in, in between you fight different types of enemies like I said you want the whole purpose is to break down their shields and then combo away but they can do combos on you too so it's like you have to memorize the way they the way they do their combos and then you know match it and and strike and get them down your weapons your weapons have uh abilities to them once they power up they may be able to whittle down their their defenses uh, more they may be able to do damage over time you know it's 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 a mix of different things and like i said before you can upgrade your weapons after you complete each little uh each little section of the of the level you're greeted with different you can either and it's a mix every time you start the level level it's, it's going to be a different starting level and different enemies so it's not like you're going to get accustomed to everything being the same exact way and performing in that manner in that manner every time but you'll be greeted with a selection of different uh upgrades that are going to be available to you just for that duration while you're alive it could be you can um, increase your health. Uh, you can increase the power of what, the power of your dash because you can dash into the enemy. That's one of your movement things. The regular movement is very very slow, but you get dashes. A lot of times I use dashes to rush to the enemy and try to take because it do, it can do a little bit of damage too. And then one of the upgrades actually brings you know actually makes your dash stronger to uh, do damage to them. But yeah, you can dash forward and, and dash back because at first playing the game, I thought it would just be one. I thought everything was going to be a one on one battle. And at times the the enemies, they, they'll jump in and out. You'll have an enemy on your left, enemy on your right. And I actually was in a situation not too long ago where, you know, I'm fighting one. I take him down. Someone from behind starts to try to attack me, you know, so I'm, I'm rushing to turn around to be like, what's going on? Yeah, it's 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 a uh, it's very it's very interesting, very interesting game. And as far as um like the immer being immersed in it, 
it's it's real arcadey. So it's the weird thing is it's like you do forget that you know you you're, you forget where your your surroundings because you're so engrossed in the combat that you're gonna if you <laughs> listen as far as the combat. Make sure that you're in an area that has nothing around because I'm in a small, I have a small play area. So I didn't, I didn't, my vibe control, I'm lucky. I'm lucky these things are as sturdy as they are because I didn't smack this wall about eight times. Eight times. I'm going to get one of those little mats. That way I, I'll know where my position is and I, I won't step out, out the way. I'm, I'm doing that tomorrow because I'm, I'm in. I'm in on this. But, um, yeah, it's 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 whew, very good game. You die a lot, you die a lot, a lot. But it's 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 fun. This 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 game is very very fun. Uh, one thing that I was kind of sad about is that like when you beat a boss, the boss isn't there anymore. You know, it's it'll just be like you know just creatures. Will, and it will be in the area where the boss was at and then you you know you move on to the next areas and you know what you really want to do while you're playing the game if you can get away with not having to uh get like you know extra health and and, and you know upgrades that's just going to be for the level i would say try to get some aether that way you know when you do start over you'll be able to upgrade your character and that'll make your playthroughs easier that's what i i started noticing you know, like, you know, the first, uh, the first, like, stages, because like, you'll have an enemy that ha doesn't have a sword, then one will have the sword, then it'll be, like, one will have, uh, you know, a be he'll, he'll have a sword, but he's, he's combo crazy. Like, it, I, I kept dying, I was doing a live stream, I kept dying, <laughs> and I'm up here thinking I'm fighting the boss. Dude, dude, was not fighting the boss at all. Was not fighting the boss at all. But, yeah, this is, um, this game, man, it's, it's, it's good combat is great i like that i like the up, that you can upgrade your weapons it really makes me feel like i'm i'm becoming stronger even though i'm starting from the freaking beginning every you know every time it's, it's, it's you do have this sense of accomplishment once you get you know up to a certain point but yeah this is uh this is definitely a buy i i want i really like to see the completed product in 2020 i hope we get a lot of extras added to it all right, but this is the Black Love Gamer. Like, share, subscribe, all that great stuff, people, and I'm out.